this state is a mismanaged mess. I mean, you can't really name anything that this governor has done well. Uh, I might have agreed with in the first couple of weeks of COVID where he you know, cautioned us to slow down in you know, two weeks to s stop the spread. But beyond that, his pandemic uh, management was an inconsistent disaster. And listen, we don't have electricity. We don't have water. We have, live in fear of fires. Crime is rising. Housing prices are out of sight. Taxes are out of sight. The homeless problem has only gotten worse. We and the, the audit today said that we don't even know what the money was spent for. We got to stop with these politicians and celebrities to Kevin and get Faulkner a business and a reminder, there. the question is, name something he's done well. And what could you see? Look, at the very beginning of COVID, we all pulled together uh, as a state. Uh, those are very difficult days for all of us. I was mayor of San Diego, and I had one goal, keeping us all uh, healthy and safe and communicating. But I think the problem we saw from this governor is, again, he went into lockdown mode. He went into a one-size-fits-all policy. That's, that just caused all of the shutdowns. That caused our school closures. That is not the right way to do it. We have to bring people together, as I did when I was mayor, Republicans, Democrats, independents, and I will make sure that we put the facts forward first and move forward in one direction, not a top-down policy. To Kevin Paffrath now, something the governor's done well that you could see continuing. The governor's done a great job at branding this election as a Republican recall. Unfortunately, he's wrong. I am a Democrat running against the governor. That's one thing he's done well, but here's the problem. We have a big threat. And that threat isn't here to defend himself. That's Larry Elder. That's because Larry Elder's with his disinformation friends, Tucker Carlson and Laura Ingram. Right before this debate aired, he went on Laura Ingram's show. It's time to end the big threat and make sure that Larry Elder does not become the next governor by voting for Kevin Paffrath. Kevin Kiley, can you name something the governor has done well that you could see continuing? So the governor actually is my constituent, I should say. Uh, he lives in my assembly district. And uh, one thing that he's done well is he does these big, splashy announcements, like he did uh, with fire mitigation efforts, which my friend over here uh, said, uh, pointed out, has, was exaggerated by 690%. Uh, there's never any follow through. But what's worse is, you know, kind of the, the image that should stay with people about Gavin Newsom is the one at the French Laundry, not because of the hypocrisy, but because of who he was there with a table full of lobbyists. That is who this governor listens to. And what we need in our next governor is someone who will actually serve the people of California.